but SRT customers aren't usually interested in the value proposition as much as the performance delivered, and this Jeep does not disappoint. 60 mph is dispatched in 4.4 seconds and the quarter mile in 13 flat. In 30 to 50 mph passing acceleration, we measured 2.9 seconds, and 50 to 70 took 3.2 seconds. These are explosive numbers by SUV standards although, subjectively, the Jeep doesn't really feel as fast as it is. For jobs beyond straight line acceleration, Jeep provides multiple driving modes that vary front slash rear torque distribution from 50 50ths in snow and tow modes to 40 60ths in auto, 35 65ths in sport, and 30 70ths in track. Those fancy red 6-piston front and 4-piston rear Brembo brake calipers and the aforementioned P0s yank this 5291 pound beast down from 70 miles per hour in 168 feet, 6 feet longer than in our last test, while lateral grip was 0.87 grams, remarkable for such a massive, high-riding vehicle, we only wish the quick steering offered at least some road feel. Had we wanted to, we could have towed a 7200 pound trailer, but we just wanted to haul ass, which explains our 14 mpg average fuel economy for our two weeks with the truck, most of which was spent blasting from stoplight to stoplight. We'll admit to being intoxicated by the sounds of that snarling hemi, some 83 decibels worth entering the cabin at wide open throttle. On the highway, however, the SRT chills out to a luxury car like 69 decibels at 70 miles per hour, thanks to active noise cancellation, which also helps mask the oral annoyances when the engine has entered cylinder deactivation mode.